use for my car. <laughs> That's not not buying the uh, the 93, 91, whatever it is. I put that I in when know. I want to go fast. You want to go fast? Yeah. Is, is that how gas works? It makes you go faster? That, yeah, that gasoline so makes that's you go a, faster? That's a ratio, the numbers, so uh -huh. the 87, 89, and 93. You can get higher, like race cars use higher, because it's a mix of gas and something. I can't remember exactly what so it you're was. you're telling me I should run the other stuff, but so that way hotter. my car goes faster. Well, it burns hotter, yeah. It's actually, if your car is designed for 89, it's designed for 89. All right, you know what we should really talk about? Talk about We're game. in game. Let's Finally. go ahead and hop on in. Uh, welcome to match number one, Steins. Going to be dropping in here as he lands inside that beautiful garage. Uh, Going to be able to get a little bit of loot here off the start. No weapon. Finds an AK, though. Actually, a pretty decent starting kit for the ground floor. Helmet. Got the military. Got a, got a rifle. Got the... Uh, I mean, pretty he, kitted. He went straight Shotgun, out. Shotgun. Like great, great opening building. Yeah, he went AR. straight out. Peaked. Kind of looking for anybody around him. He was ready to take a fight very early. I think, uh, I think he's going to go for some aggressive push. But right there, you can see Tamara... Which we talked about. Again, not super confident Ooh. taking this fight. Immediately gets the helmet removed. No backpack, so there's not going to be a helmet in tow to come back on. Nothing in uh, your feet. Got to watch the toes. Got to watch the toes. Oh. Tamara going to get caught out there. Storm is best. Going to get like that, that opening outfit. elimination. You like the little the little green elf? I'm, I'm all about green. It's my oh. favorite color. Oh, okay. I'm not a big green guy. My whole outfit's green. Brazil hoodie. Hey, we're in the right region. You are, you I are. rock a Brazil hoodie, guys, if you didn't know. Caster Bias. <laughs> Caster Bias. This is my favorite region. All right, so Flax, one of those guys that you were talking about mm -hmm. a little bit, and it looks like he's kind of hanging out, waiting on... Ba balance? B... It would be B-A-L-A-N-A-C... There's a four in everything. -A -C B B no, it's B-L-N-C-R. Blanker? Hmm. Well, Not regardless, sure. he's outside. B4. We're going to call him B4. <sighs> B4 hanging outside, getting a vehicle there. T, looks like he's checking out this building here. Deli right behind that door. No backpack, so he's... Definitely not kitted to the point that he wants to be. Looks like he's going to go ahead and back off and get out of there. Leave him alone. Looks like Deli threw a grenade and ends up taking out that entire fence line. T going to take off, though. So we're not going to see this battle go down at the moment. And, and that's now, the right call. That, that's, that's the right call. There, the right there's call. no there's no need to take that fight. If you do get into the fight, with if T takes that fight, the other player needs loot. He's probably willing to take that fight to get the loot because you've just looted the building that he was going to go to mm -hmm. anyways. Um Better to just walk away. There's no reason to go down this early in the match. And that's something I didn't notice in any in any of the EU games, really, when we were watching looting phase. But Blacked up, picked up that shirt, shredded it. Get those bandages for late game, because late game bandages actually are really important. It's just gaming, taking a couple opening shots here onto Johnny Fast. Not getting any real hits. Uh, doesn't get any hits onto him, so he's going to be able to get away. But going to have the gas station for free to himself. Looks like the doors are closed. Doesn't look looted. Going to be able to grab a helmet. Looks like he shredded it. So Mitch just trying to finish off his kit, get a little bit more stacked up. Doesn't look like he's looting the AK yeah, or the say, shotgun. So I think he's probably feeling all right. He's probably looking for crafting mm -hmm. uh, crafting and healables. Well, Maybe some too. throwables. Right across from looks like Walder can get his name, but the kill comes in as Ooh. El Pito finds Macau's head. It looks like a quick elip there. A nice play bullets. shots. Not too too many, but a Pito will make his way over. Now able to loot that delicious candy. That, that candy. I bullets. I actually love. I I really do. I I like the uh, I like the new loot bags for Halloween. Oh, 100 percent, 100 percent. I don't think that's the last loot bag we're gonna see either. I think. Uh, I, I hope not. I, I actually heard I, talks I, out there. I, I like the changes. Yeah, it's little. It's the little things that just kind of make you feel more immersed in the game. Like like they care, you know? Because I I don't think I've ever met someone who cares as much as this group does. They really All do. All right, opening circle actually going to take off, so we haven't seen this circle yet. We have seen an east safe zone. It was all the way up in Ranchito, though. This one going to be straighty, so a little bit of a uh, zone you want to see sitting in there. Yeah, that's Villas, exactly why. Right. Villas is sitting in there. So there could be potential, absolutely, for the Villas to be a big part of this. If this shifts pretty heavy to the north, we could get the zone I wanted exactly. But Spence Hills is not out of this. Bubba's is in this. 
a good chunk of players are actually in the zone currently too, which is very interesting. It was pretty east loaded on the spawn, mm -hmm. so yeah, most of them have made it in. They're gonna be okay, uh, not having to move too far. But those guys on the west, again, when they when it's a hard east or hard west or hard, they, really the corners are the worst. But going far east or west sets it up, and we're gonna see some shots come out of Thuzma. Gonna easily take out Sicario. Quick kill. He's gonna pick up a vehicle and some loot, and times his hop with perfection. Mm. into that car as the body disappears out of there. But those safe zones, you're going to want things like a vehicle to get yourself right. across the map. Got, you can. You can run it. You can get caught by the gas. You can run it. And the safe zone, most likely going that far east, is probably going to pull back a little bit west. You'll make it to the safe zone. Um, but you won't have the lay of the land coming out of the gas. And that's one of the things that sometimes being in the gas isn't great unless you make it out in that opening zone. Mm -hmm. um, you make it out in the opening zone and there's not too many elims yet. You kind of shift your way around in a car. On foot, it's rough. You come out on foot and you can't really move around to get a lay of the right, land. You're, right, right. you're down. One, you're coming in late. Two, you're probably damaged from the gas. Three, you don't know where anybody is. Everybody sees you coming in. You don't have the vehicle to get to where you need to go. Mm -hmm. um, so really, those guys are probably looking for cars over on that far side, trying to at least find an ATV. Well, here's that player you were talking about, Titanico, someone you wanted to pay attention to. No kills on the board yet, but looks like he has a pretty much full health Jeep. Maybe has 20 damage, if any. I don't think there's any damage on that car whatsoever. That looks pretty crispy and new. Maybe a few damage if he hits this fence. Okay, he lost two damage, two. one damage. It'll be all right. And this is really that kind of opening rotation spot, right? Where we're going into circle one, gas is moving. This is where people are going to start trying to figure out where they want to be for that next circle. Really, they're tr they're looking ahead and whole, a, a full circle past this. Players that need to make a long trek, though, Vampsy, one of the guys that in our match of whatever it was called. The one that called, doesn't exist, yeah. The, the match that we just watched our these guys warm game. up in. Um He's going to be one of the guys doing the late rotation. He doesn't appear to be moving really fast. He might be a guy on foot that left too late. Oh, very possible. But look at this. Chabuk's right near Fandu. But looks like I don't, I don't think they're going to push too much. Again, right now with the full lobby like we have, people really aren't going for fights. They're really relaxing. The pace has definitely changed. 30 players make such a difference in these lobbies. It's how quickly you have to start playing in a non, I guess non-committal or a, a, a way that you're not going to move around much. You're going to hold one set area where when we were at 40 players, we were kind of watching them rotate much sooner. Mm -hmm. They were willing to move because there was that extra breathing room. They had a little little elbow space. Now they don't quite have as much. We're going to see the smoke nade come out from Welder as he tries to spray some shots into uh Kisoa there, not able to get the hits. He was also in that battle as he took shots in the back from Bull. Looks like he's going to find his way out on foot. Looking for some shots here. Lorenzo trying to find hits onto Shaman. Shaman going to be able to get out of there, though. Again, people are just running, but it was interesting. There's a lot of zone that hasn't been, been covered by the gas yet, and they just got caught in it. So their exact situation that we we're talking about, they're still fighting in it realistically. Yeah, that's there's a the lot scary of people. Thing. Look at that whole north area. There's a bunch of players, whole bunch coming out in the north, uh, the northwest. Everybody tried to rotate northeast. through the same exact spot in the water there, coming out of Ranchito, which mm -hmm. is which is rough, and it's putting a lot of them at risk right now. And even if you do win it, the guys there's there's a couple players that could probably hear the shots that might be able to get involved and get some elims there at the end. Oof. 2KD trying to get some magnum shots there. He's fully kitted out. He's uh looking pretty clean, rocking all rogue skins. You're not biased there, right? Uh, I mean, I mean, I might have worked for them at one point. It's uh, just just in general though, the the actual rogue skins are some of my favorite ones. Them gangstars, I like gangstars look a lot too. Mm -hmm. And anything that is red, Thank white, and yellow. black, any oh, of the red, white, fair. and black skins, just because red, white, and black always looks good. I, I, that's fair. I've always. Loved I didn't think I was gonna like the rogue skins at first either. Just like blue and orange is kind of like a weird. That's interesting. We just saw Fandu and Chabuk actually get a kill assisting each other almost 50-50 when they were in that earlier battle. And now these long shots from Tag Dylan over to Nash. Try and hit the ATV. Smart call. Doesn't pull it off, though. Yeah, maybe 
maybe they got upset. They were trying to have their fight, and somebody came in and was one of those, like, we're busy here. Yeah, we're busy. Both, Stop. Yeah, you walked in at the wrong time, and you get the anger of both people in the fight. 50-50, uh, I mean, that's a nice trade. That keeps it even as they go back into their own fight. Mm -hmm. Well, Teason's got Xena very close. Ooh. You heard that shot come in. He's going to jump out. Go for it. Down he goes. There's a Zena full, full commit there from T as he goes ahead and just throws himself out the window and jumps out to take that fight. Nice placed shot out of Xena. Gets the helmet. Not going to be able to get any more hits, though. Player is going to get away from him. The King going to flip over on his uh, Boom. daybreak ATV there. That thing uh, is a rental. I think he needs to return that in better condition than he's going to. No, nah, it's a lease. He's fine. It's somebody <laughs> else's problem in three years. You and this lease. I'm never letting you lease anything from me. What would you lease me? I don't know. Maybe I become a leasing business in the near future. Oh, okay. I'm just going to have a no Jason. I understand. I'm, yeah. I'm not Adam's wanted. only because Adam's greater than Jason. Mm. Boldo going to be holding down that bathroom. I don't, I don't see either of these players going anywhere until they are absolutely forced to. That is a doors closed. They've closed all the doors in their building. That's a full committal to I'm not moving. Yeah, there you go. Full committal to I'm not moving. I'm staying right here. You can't make me. You, the gas can make go. me. You, on the other hand, cannot make me go anywhere. Titanic goes up. can't quite tell exactly where it is. Tia Gao going to get taken out by Illumin Illuminike? Ooh. Oh, sees him making the move. He's going to go ahead and run out the back door looking for it. Comes for the for the back door oh, trying to drive away. Ego just, general. yeah, doesn't want the fight. He's definitely playing for that top 10 position. This is this is a strategy that you're going to see a lot of people go for. They want the top 10 for the skin. Mm -hmm. So they're going to play these types of positions until the late game. And we always see that happen at like top 20. It kind of bubbles and everybody stops. Everybody tries to figure out, slows do the down. slows down. Yeah. Do I want to fight? Do I? Is it worth it? Then once we get to like Ooh. 15, it's anything past 20, really, everybody's very, very patient. This hotel is running out of vacancy very quickly. It's got one more. It had two spots. Two spots were left in. Two rooms available. No, one of them, one of them, I think, is blocked off. I don't think you can get into all of them, can you? That middle one on the three sides. Uh, I think there was one on the left and then one on the right that was available. Like top left. But those were both been taken. I could See, be very yeah, wrong. Top you left, are right. You top are right. To the right. I'll give you this one. All right. <laughs> All right. Sorry. I'm sorry. Frost has the nice. There's a there's a lot of fans of bathrooms too. I don't know if you've noticed this, mm -hmm. but uh, bathroom. Seems I think that's to be one of those place. things you should do before you parachute down. I agree. Yeah. Go to the bathroom. If not, and you haven't parachuted before. It could be a disaster. <laughs> Hang out with David though. He's <laughs> no. Is that no backpack? I didn't so I, that. that player, to me, looked like he didn't have a backpack on. He looks like he may have landed in that building and hasn't left since the start of the game. That would be quite impressive. 30-30. Uh, uh, I, I don't see a backpack on I him. don't see a backpack either. Has he literally been here the entire game? David's commit to the I need to make top 10 before I move came in very early. I'll be really curious to see if this pays off for him at all. If that pays off, I'm I'm going to applaud that man. I'm trying I'm going to find out now where he, right here. He's 64th. He qualified in 64th. So we know he has the ability to push. I mean, these are the 75 best players in the region. So seeing something like that is really interesting to me. Right, B4 gonna be coming into the into the safe zone out of the gas in his patriotic Jeep. Looks like he's gonna go ahead and find the rock, just park and use that as that little Ooh. 90 degree corner to hide out in. Bubba's still safe, so David's not gonna have to move, but man, is this circle going to light up. Most of the houses will start getting moved into here pretty quick. Some opening shots here from B4 as he fights into Fandu. Fandu out in the open, but Fandu is the one bringing the pressure right now, hitting the last couple shots, trying to find a couple spray shots into that vehicle. Not able to get the hit. Yeah, he's backing off when he is technically up in the fight. However, he's rotating onto the other player's car. No longer has a way to get out of there. Magnum shots coming out, trying to connect onto that Patriotic Jeep. Molotov going to be long, throwing downhill. It's going to be a little too much sizzle on that throw. A little too much pepper in that arm. Going a little far. B4 gave so much respect to Fandu there, and he does end up going out. Xavier pinches him from the other side. I don't know. B4, you're right. He had 100% the position there, and he just didn't do anything. 
He didn't. He didn't make much use of it. I yeah. didn't see him doing anything that that warranted that play. David Ooh. though has nothing, needs nothing. Shotgun he, kill. Gonna take down a player. He now has everything. He just netted himself everything that player had. So he's gonna be able to get backpacks, extra helmets, etc. And the guy delivered him a car. It's like David just special yeah, delivery. David knew. I mean, he just he had he put his feels out. He waited for it. And in comes. There was a backpack in there. It's Halloween. It's not Christmas yet. I don't understand. A red car just came flying through the door and gifted him everything he needs. Well, Lorenzo putting shots down over to Ban Banda, Bandanina. Ooh, B4 gets taken out elsewhere by a Molotov at the hands of Delhi Duke. TV going to choke out to the gas. There's B4 as he uh, heads, hides his uh, head in shame there in the ground. I don't know if you noticed that, but he's just kind of... <laughs> just burying it like an yeah, ostrich. Yeah, he just pulled the ostrich maneuver there for Jola. Going to find himself in elimination with that shotgun, and Benny Monster going to get a finish with either a gas nade or hit a player in the gas. I think it was in the gas, because the gas nade comes up as a gas nade. Yeah. Well, try, I mean, Wesley's still out in that gas moving in. Has not come all the way down. He's about 30% health. He's getting hurt pretty quick. But Chavo goes down. So does Ion. And actually, Wesley got that kill from inside the gas. So I don't know, man. moving in, trying to find a spot to hang out. Looks like he was looking at that bathroom a little bit. Oh. Ooh, here's a shoddy battle up close and personal. Nelson going to lose that one to Volto. Always so tough. Those again, we were talking about the bathrooms, and well, another battle inside the bathroom happens. And you can see there's still other players there. Triceps is still there, so is Ricardo Hugh. Now, in in so has come up. We see Strike Zone now getting his first kill of the game, and he did pretty well last time hiding out. Attack Dylan gonna find himself an elimination onto Delhi. We can see that was gonna be an explosion. I believe that was at the hands of Magnum, so he probably blew that car up on him. Trapdo hanging out over here at this tree. Nobody really around giving him any trouble, though. A couple shots from the one side, but nobody close enough to really put a hurt on him. There's Strike Zone again, all camoed out. We haven't seen him in any bushes yet, but who knows? It didn't pay off for him in the warm up game. And here's David actually deciding to come out. Now that he's fully looted, he can go. Doesn't have a vehicle, though. Titanico going to make him make his way onto the board as he gets a grenade kill. Xavier going to go down. We can hear that just off in the distance as he goes down to the shoddy of Benny Monster. Benny Monster getting looted up right here across the street from David over at the uh, car wash. And here comes nothing. I, I honestly thought that there was going to be a hop there from Ricardo to spray down triceps, but doesn't happen. Gold Vitno going to go down to Pasaki. So Pasaki still in this one. Again, that's one of those players that has taken. Ooh, Titanico gets eliminated by Vamsi. FBI Frost, FBI Allison both going to go down. And that kill feed is now just taken off. Yeah, this is it. This is that moment where everything goes crazy. We saw Vanina go down. We've seen Chunks. That was very close. Got him down to about half health. Volto's able to get out. Trap those. That would have been best. a nasty shot. Yeah, had, if he had headshotted had he it. he pumped him there, that would have been nasty. David, unfortunately, oh, not going to make it much him. farther into the match as he gets eliminated. Ferjola going to go down to Tox. Benny Monster now looking for shots onto Ligu. Has him down to 12 health. Knows that he's ahead. Steps out. Gets the finish. That's the type of aggression when it's smart. That's the right play. Good step up by Benny Monster to finish that one off. Triceps going down elsewhere on the map to a shoddy. And Bull going to go down at 33rd to Bamsey. And Benny now has SB or S2 right in front of him. I don't know if S2 is the name, if Ricardo Hughes is the name of the team. Or, but look, now Gravis is right here too. That's going to be the position given away for S2. But he is using that air conditioner as a bit of a cover for right now. Going to throw the gas grenade. That will force Benny Monster off to the left. So there will be no battle here, it looks like. It might take some time. Benny gone already, right up against the edge of the gas here. Ricardo, he knows that it's coming. He's going to move early, not get touched by the gas. But had to prove me wrong. Gets touched by the gas. <laughs> now And now going to take off. But you can see him starting to recognize at the 10-second mark that he needed to be gone. He didn't yeah. need to wait. He started moving. And that's one of those things that makes a difference. Little things like that. Shaman going to get sprayed down here as he goes down to Trapdo. One showman going to find himself a kill elsewhere with a head tap with a beautiful unicorn AR. I feel like we did see Trapdo get a kill earlier. He did get one earlier. So it's still showing one, I believe, but it should have two at this point. 
It may just be the UI yeah. behind. I, he's definitely been in the feed. Or no, he was in a fight earlier and he survived. I don't think he actually got the kill. He must have got the kill stolen. Unfortunate for him. But there's Pisaki getting a kill on the Mitch's gaming with that gold AR. And here's our zone. That's this not is, a lot of people in there. This is going to be a rough one. Tack Dylan already in that zone. I'm not sure. I'm trying to remember what that actual area looks like. Once we get into it, we'll be able to tell. There may not be a really good spot for him to hold in the middle of that zone. Pasaki going to find himself another kill. Nesh going to find himself an elimination. Tox coming out. There's that Same again. mistake. You can do that throwable if you are outside the window. Mm -hmm. If you are inside with them, unless you are backed all the way up against the other window, throw from there and step left, you cannot time it well enough. You're going to have to be so frame perfect on that shot to pull it off, it's just not worth it. You've got to step outside, throw it in, and then catch them when they rotate from that to the other door. Lorenzo, FPS, going to get taken out by a headshot there Ooh, by Lelio. Going to try to use the vehicle. Ooh. Very obvious move. Tackdown should have been able to pick up on that, but he's going to go down as... So wasn't able to get those shotgun shots where he needed them to. He's still in a good spot. 13th is is a good average spot to kind of start out. Yeah. He's got yeah, yeah, yeah. you know game two, game three to still go. We're at top 12. We're just on the bubble of going into the top 10 here. Trapdo still in this one. Has that single elimination and has more ammo than anybody should ever be carrying. 450 rounds. Why, man, are you not carrying more helmets? Uh, I mean, the Ooh, best, comes uh, out. best defense is good offense. I, I guess. Unless you're playing Z1, somebody's going to shoot you in the head. Well, speaking of shooting in the head, strike zone has the bullets raining down towards Gas him. is about to envelop him as well, so he's not out of there quick enough. Now Trapdo's going to be right there with him. Tra Trill Hero gets Ooh. taken out. That's Zeta skin. It sounded like an explosion, too. I think Zeta just blew him up with the Maggie there. Very possible. Could have hit him out of the vehicle, too. I mean, we've seen how scary these Magnums can be. Yeah, the Magnus definitely having quite a bit of play here today. Oh. Pasaki just outside the top 10, going to go down in 11th, but it's still a good opening match for him. Nesh going to go down now to Bronx. Bronx, who we saw hit some pretty nasty shots in game version 1.0. Oh, oh, or push. And, uh, yeah, aggressive push here. Another shotgun push coming in, and that is going to be it for Bronx. Shiko, S2, going to take him down. You can tell Bronx is still there talking to him, too. He probably was not pleased with that one. Zeta skin here. He's a one our warm up game. Now in a top seven, so we talk about consistency and how important it is. Just be consistent. Right now, yeah, he's showing a lot of consistency, but he's not in a good spot. That, he's not driving consistently. That is. You, you get turn it left a little bit there. Uh, oh, it looks like he's watching out for that smoke nade. He, I don't know that he knows that player's right ahead of him there on the other side of that rock. Well, he may find out the hard way. Going to make a new makeshift armor. Trapto gets taken out by Vamsi. Vamsi again, also playing very consistently. This is the moment. Oh, the whoa! beam through the smoke onto Showman. Showman getting tagged up here. Zeta looking for some oh. kills and ends up oh. paying for it. Leon picking up a double kill as he cleans that one up. That's the player that we were talking about that Zeta wasn't aware of, mm -hmm. and he punishes him. Punishes not only him, but the other player as well. And now the shotgun battle comes out as Vamsi. Makes his way into the number third position. With a drop shot there, and here comes Leon on the push. Looking for the finish. Shotgun shells going oh. out. Leon going to get taken out here. Shiko, S2, going to take down match number one of South America. I mean, there we go. That's exactly what we're talking about. That There's so much aggression.